Lonzo Lonzo, super actor. He's got a big movie out, and he's a DC native. Thanks for stopping in, man. My pleasure. Thanks Pre for having me. Appreciate you stopping in. Absolutely. All right, so you're going to be making an announcement of a draft pick at the stadium on Saturday. Hopefully, I won't butcher any names. Well, we have to find the time when the time comes. You know, it might be, <laughs> might be a tough one. How right. excited are you to be be at FedEx Field to do this gig? I'm I'm excited, man. You know, I, I uh, whenever I'm working in the area, I always find a way to get to a Redskins home game or a few. Um, most of my friends are season ticket holders, and so for me, it's a treat to be back. It, for any reason, I find an excuse to get back there is great. Now, let's talk about the movie Traffic with a K. It's out. I can't wait to see it. I've seen the trailers. Give us your view of what this movie's all about. So it is a story of four couples that go up to the mountains for a nice little sexy, romantic getaway from the city, and uh, once they're up there, all kinds of Heck breaks loose. Yeah. 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 Things things hit the fan. Yeah. You can imagine what things hit the fan. Yeah. It's uh it's stuff hits the fan. Stuff. A lot of stuff. A lot of stuff hits the fan. It's it looks like a very intense movie. What was it like shooting it? Uh, you know, it's an action thriller. Um, it was a lot of fun to shoot. I'll tell you, you know, for my character especially because you know I'm the comic relief of the movie. Like I actually get to be funny <laughs> in this one. And uh, uh, you know, I, I guarantee a lot of you won't like me after you see the movie. Ah, uh, come on now. You know, but but I'm that one friend that that you know's got your back. I'll say that. Okay. Through thick and thin. It's good. Um, how, how long does it take to shoot a movie like that? It, 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 it was it shot on location. You know, the average movie takes usually about three months to film. Um, it was shot on location. This one we did it a little under two months because it was an indie. So it was an independent movie, completely, you know, financed by one guy, uh, Robert Frederick Smith. I don't know if you're familiar with him. Uh, African-American billionaire based out of Denver. And uh, he's in the movie business. So he's, he's, he's financing a company called Hidden Empire, Deion Taylor, Roxanne Event, uh, writer, director, producers. And they kind of have this little small, you know, hidden gem of a film company and they started their own studio and they're putting out these great movies meet the blacks uh, they have more movies that are going to drop this year and this was kind of their coming out party and uh, you know we were a uh, top 10 movie uh, number one indie film last week uh, hit the you know hit the box office strong and so uh, we want everybody to go out and keep supporting the film it's a good movie really traffic good movie. with a K yes traffic with a, traffic K. With a K and and wow you've had a heck of a career man I'll tell you I know when you were coming in here for the last couple of weeks when we announced the team announced that you're gonna make that pick uh, you got a list of movies a mile long. Uh, has your career uh, exceeded your expectations? I know the sky as you're still grinding. Sure. You're still you're st but but uh, your thoughts on how your career has gone. You know, it's it's hard to really say because, you know, you always have that, you know, just like we want the Super Bowl. Yes. As an actor, you want the Oscar. Yes. You know, so uh, being nominated, you know, when when I was in Avatar, you know, having the film nominated, that was a a great great moment, you know, to be able to participate in the festivities and and all that kind of pomp and circumstance is great, you know, but I still want to, uh, I don't think I'll ever be truly satisfied until I at least get a chance and be nominated for, for the big one. Oh, invite me when you do. Come on, brother. It's a, hey, fans it's might be a Redskins party when I do. <laughs> well, I know where you're from, but let our viewers know where you're from. Here's our camera right here. Born and raised Washington, D.C., Northwest D.C. Yeah. We called it uptown when I was yeah. growing up here. St. John's. That's it. St. John's College wow. High School. And a bison. Howard, Howard University bison. Wow. I'm D.C. all the way, just, just like you are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's great to have you on the show. And what's next for you? This movie is going to be a big hit, folks. Traffic with the K. Check it out. Extremely intense. He wouldn't tell me what happened at the end. He's forcing me to go see the movie. I want you to go see it, man. Yeah. Um, so my next project is for Amazon. Uh, all the Amazon Prime, you know, customers out there, you get to get to watch this series. It's called The Boys, and it's based on a graphic novel. And basically, it's set in this kind of uh, surreal world where superheroes have decided to go rogue. Oh, oh boy! That's and they're out of control. Out of control. You know who who stops the superheroes? If Superman know. wanted to come rob your house, yeah. who, what you gonna do? It's King Kong versus Godzilla. <laughs> that's, exactly. That's exactly. That's what it is. Yep. I'll see you on Saturday. At yes, Medicare. sir. I really appreciate it. Everybody here with the Redskins appreciate you coming in to make this pick. It's my pleasure. This is my team to the day I die, and I'm just I'm happy to be here and participate with fellow Redskins fans.